The Mexicarte Museum is dedicated to cultural enrichment and education through the collection, preservation, and presentation of traditional and contemporary Mexican, Latino, and Latin American art and culture to promote dialogue and develop understanding for visitors of all ages. In 1984, the museum was founded by artists at the Arts Warehouse. Mexicarte was one of the first museums in downtown Austin. The permanent collection began in 1984 and includes works by important artists such as Jose Guadalupe Posada. The collection also includes hundreds of ceremonial masks from the state of Guerrero. Joaquin Clausel's art is a unique example of Mexican Impressionism from the early 20th century in the collection. Selections from the contemporary art collections included Cartonado by Laredo artist Gil Rocha. With tours, family days, events, and classes, over 5,000 students are reached each year. Mexicarte is the official archive of the Serie project, a silkscreen workshop in Austin. In addition, the museum received a significant donation from Ernesto de Soto, the first Mexican-American master printer, including works by José Luis Cuevas. From Revolution to Renaissance, Mexican Art from the Aaron Collection featured modern art from 1900 to 1950. In 2011, Sam Coronado, a retrospective, featured works created over 40 years of his career. In 2014, Illustrating Anarchy and Revolution was organized in collaboration with La Casa Museo Mexico City and UT Austin, along with a symposium based on the historical events of journalists Ricardo and Enrique Flores Magón. In 1996, Mexicarte developed the Young Latino Artist Exhibition Program as a forum for young curators and artists from Texas. Each year, the YLA Curator makes studio visits in various cities. The 19th annual YLA included an installation and performance by Fabiola Torrabla. The YLA exhibit includes new innovative works. Curator Rikianas selected artists for the 20th annual YLA exhibit. In 2016, YLA curated by David Sheck Vega included 18 artists from Texas. Sebastian, The Geometry of Space and Time, will be the first time the artist's works are shown in Austin. Sebastian is one of Mexico's most important contemporary sculptors. In the fall of 2017, the museum will open Diego y Frida, A Smile in the Middle of the Way, a photography exhibition that spans the lives of Mexico's best-known artists. The museum's photography collection exhibit will include 31K Portraits for Peace by Diego Huerta that represent the over 31,000 lives lost as a result of violence. Works by Santiago Forero will be included in the photography exhibit. As part of a collaborative mobile gallery cart titled Changarrito, Mexicarte monthly selects artists to showcase their work at Fifth in Congress and other sites. In 2016, Mexicarte received the National Arts and Humanities Youth Program Award for the museum's education programs. Screen It pairs students with artists to teach printmaking and graphic arts. Annually, the museum's director leads an art education trip to Mexico. In 1984, Mexicarte held the first Day of the Dead event in Austin. In 2014, Dennis McNett created an Aztec bat sculpture for the procession. In 2016, over 6,000 participants enjoyed the 32nd annual Viva la Vida Parade and Festival. On the museum wall on 5th Street, messages and murals directed to bilingual audiences welcome everyone to the museum.